Tiffany Haddish was the woman who revealed Baines had been bitten in the face by an actress at the after party for a Jay Z concert in Inglewood, California in December 2017. The up and coming star, 38, dropped the news during an April GQ interview, sending shockwaves among the babes, which is the name of Baines's followers. But on Wednesday at the Turner Up Fronts, Haddish said she has since talked to the single ladies hitmaker and that she is cool with her leaking the news. Tiffany was plugging her last dog show when she talked to people about the comments. We've talked since then, and it's been cool, the actress who is twice divorced from William Stewart said. Nobody's tripping except for everybody else. Tiffany told GQ that an actress who was allegedly on drugs bit Baines's face at a party. Soon after fans tried to guess who it could be. Haddish can't say who the woman is because she signed an NDA. The stars at the after party were Rihanna, James Franco, French Montana, Queen Latifah, G Easy, Diddy, Sarah Foster, Jen Meyer, and Sina Lathan. So far, the suspects have included Lathan, Lena Denham, Foster, and Taraji P. Henson. But they have all said it's not them. I would never do anything malicious like that to her or to anyone. It's so bizarre. I thought it was the funniest thing ever that it was a news story. It's so crazy. I didn't think it was going to blow up like that, Haddish said. Haddish has seen her star power rise fast in the past few months. Her career began in 2013 when she appeared on Real Husbands of Hollywood. That was followed by If Loving You Is Wrong on Own the following year. Next came the NBC sitcom The Carmichael Show, and then High C in 2017, Haddish landed a breakout role as she starred alongside Queen Latifah, Jada Pinkett Smith, and Regina Hall in the comedy film Girls Trip. In August 2017, Haddish's comedy special, Tiffany Haddish, She Ready. From the Hood to Hollywood, premiered on Showtime. Months later she became the first black female stand-up comedian to host Saturday Night Live. She's now working with Tracy Morgan in The Last Dog, and she will also be in night school alongside Kevin Hart. My life has changed in so many ways, but not that many ways, she also told People on Wednesday. The only thing is I work on a regular basis, and I'm able to provide for my family even better now 